Okay, let's talk about combinations. So, combinations is actually that like you generate combination and then you return all of possible combination for the integer n and k. So, what's integer? So, integer is like from one to n, and k is the 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 length of the subset. So, you will definitely understand how do you do a backtrack in this video. So, you need a list of lists to store the value, right? So I'm gonna call this equal to new array list. So uh, I'm gonna pick call backtrack first. So what I actually do is I backtrack. I'm using the vo void type. So backtrack, and I need to. I definitely need list of this right integer and this and also integer n integer k and what I would do. I would definitely need a temporary list. And what I also need is my starting value, right? Starting value. So the starting value is one, it's not zero, right? So that's the idea, okay? So what you actually do is backtrack. You will call this, you will call n, you will call k, you will call this of integer, right? So which is temp, and also you're starting from one, right? And you just return this. That's pretty much standard backtrack. And what we'll actually do is okay, what happened to my k? Why do I pass in k? k is 2, right? So I would decrement every single time when I uh, call a backtrack. So if my k equal to 0, which means I can add to a list, right? Okay. This standard, if k equal to 0, I can add to the list. So I'm. I'm going to add my temp to the list, but I'm not going calling a uh, temp uh, uh, temp list. I'm going to new array list and add a temp into the list because the type, right? When you add, you when you add, you can just return. That would be simple, straightforward. So uh, let's just start. How do you do it? So you will say i equal to star and i less than equal to n minus k plus one. Okay, why do I plus one? Because the equal sign value and I plus plus. So you might not you might think like what should I use n minus k plus one. So imagine n equal to four. Four minus two is two, two plus one, three. So it will start from one, two, three. Right? One, two, three. So one, the first thing that we see is one, two, three, right? You are not using the four on your first index, right? So they, this is pretty tricky. You will save a lot of time. So n minus k plus one, four minus two, two plus one is one. So uh, two plus one is three. Sorry, three. So the first index you will, you will have is from one to three. You will not like try the full full value on your first index. It's not possible because uh, you when you add you add to add the uh, in uh, ascending order, right? So. Is a way okay so what you actually do is you add the i and you remove the i right and how do you remove you remove the last index that's the way okay so let's talk about backtrack so what you actually do is you need n uh, i mean you need this you need n you need you don't need k you decrement k and what you actually need to do you need temp right and start you start will become i plus one right that's the pretty standard so you are not using the same value, so 2, 2 is not allowed, so that is the idea. And let's see. And it's good, and it's also good. Okay, let's talk about time and space. So, uh, what do you think? So, you are starting from, you will generate a tree, which is out of n. Height is all of n, but for each level, it is all of. So you either pick or not pick the value, right? So it's all of two time n minus k plus one. You have n minus k plus one possibility for each level, right? Right. So it's two to the n minus k plus one, and time time. I mean, let less time and space. It's also n, I mean 2 to the n minus k plus 1. Uh, you'll generate 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, right? So 
2 to the 6 should be I mean it's around it's around right 6 is less than 8 right so it's around 2 to 8 so that would be your solution and I hope you get it so if I'm wrong on the time and space let me know and the question is so good and good luck